Yes, I'm not gonna lie. This is, this is. Here out in the field day one. I'm feeding a garter snake. It's late, just got a snake call for Cottonmouth. Just snakes after snakes after snakes. Get off this road first. All right, um, it's late. I just got a snake call for a cottonmouth on somebody's front porch. I'm super tired, been at work all day, but no matter what, we still try and get out there. We try and get the snakes uh, to help ease human animal conflicts. I got a baby rattlesnake out of a yard yesterday. It's just snakes after snakes after snakes um, all around down here in South Florida. It's been crazy busy. All right, guys, let's go get that cottonmouth. There's my headlamp. All right, we just got here. The snake is on her front patio. So we're gonna go check it out and catch him. Oh, he's a little baby. Oh yeah, look at that. Look at that, curled up right by the front patio. He's captured. Do you want to see him? There you go. Yeah, that was a pretty good one, huh? Yeah. I'm a small doll, but yeah, good I, spot. I yeah, yeah. So what do yeah. you do with it? I'm just gonna take him a couple miles down the road and let him go. I just pick him up to help people and help oh, the snakes. Awesome. And well, I really appreciate this. Yeah. I'm just glad you didn't leave. I said, no. Oh my God, you're back. welcome. Yeah, it's quick and easy, right? <laughs> All right. Have, you, yeah, you're welcome. Have a good night. The snake is captured, super easy capture. Uh, small cottonmouth sleeping by the front porch. Cottonmouths are so easy, so laid back. Grabbed them, dropped them in the bucket, and now I'm just gonna take him home. I live down the street, and uh, we'll let him go tomorrow together. See you then. All right, guys, so before we head out, we we're gonna do our usual bike ride, and uh, we were telling you how Toby hates bikes. Isn't that true, Toby? bikes forever he tries to jump off into the tires so so since he hates bikes we got him a little basket to ride in so he could be extra lazy during our workout yep so now he gets to go just about everywhere with us all right tobe ready, ready? Get on there. and he loves his little basket look at that toby so now you don't get to miss out on any more of the bike finds what? now he gets to find all of the rattlesnakes with us <laughs> toby, okay say toby you ready Probably the worst Uber driver Toby's ever had, right, but Tob, let's go. adios, Tobos. <laughs> hey, Toby man, you flying? Hey, Tob. This Uber driver is getting one star. You're so cute. Toby, what's it like having me obsessed with you? Look at that stupid hair. <laughs> Look at these clouds. I'm getting real sick of this rain and bad weather this week. I can't complain, we live in Florida. How'd you twist yourself? So we made it. We made it to the canal. Okay. You gonna go out tonight and get crazy, Toad? We're gonna release that cotton mouth tonight. Fish bump. Big cypress fox squirrel. Huh. Dude, this is a really rare squirrel, Taylor. Okay, so you're a danger venomous reptile bucket. All right, so this is the cotton mouth that we caught last night. Yeah, come here. He's actually a really pretty little guy. Toby, stay on me. Toby's trying to get the boobs. Oh, he's so cool. Yeah, look at that little guy. He's got a pretty big belly too. Looks like he's got a little meal in his stomach. So these juvenile cotton mouths, what I've noticed a lot when we post cotton mouths 
is people will ask like, oh, why does it have so much pattern? I thought they were black. Um, when they're juveniles, they'll have this bullseye pattern down the side, and they'll also have this yellow tip. Is it still yellow on his tail? Yeah. They'll have this yellow tip on their tail. They can retain this pattern into adulthood. However, they don't always. Sometimes they will turn completely black and a lot of times they'll be faded. It just depends on individual. They come in all different, you know, essentially colors, but they will often lose that yellow tipped tail. That tail is really cool. They use that as a special, what's called caudal lure. Um, when they're looking for, they'll lie in ambush. It's chasing you. They'll lie in ambush and they will wait for little frogs and lizards and they'll take that tail and they'll flick it around and make it look like a lure of frog hops over and the snake whoop, bites him and then uh, turns him into a meal. So this is a really pretty little cotton mouth. And like I said, I caught this last night on somebody's front porch and now we're gonna let it go. I can put it on the road and get B-roll real quick. You might have to, I can't. It's like, what are those fingers? So once he realized they're human fingers, he goes the other way. All okay, right. guys. Got Brett's going to let it go now. He got some B-roll. Toby's trying to jump at it, so I had to walk away with Toby Man. Well, people always think that like the snake they came across was much more aggressive than the one we came across. If they're you're more, spastic, they're spastic. The way you act around them dictates how they're going to act around you. There you go. Go into the rocks. Come on, scram. Let's go. Go. Come on. So, why are you walking all fours like a cat? Here out in the field, day one. It is raining. Toby hates the rain. We it's, keep trying to hike and then it's storming. It's raining. It's actually a cold rain. It's probably gonna shut down the activity. We might be able to find some stuff in between this rain. Uh, but we're gonna try and get out and do some night hiking. Oh. In between the... <laughs> he just like knocked you down. Toby's hyped. I hope you're hyped. I'm hyped. Let's get out there and see what we can find. Toby, come on, come on. Woo! See? Ah. Dang, that hair's getting long. Long hair don't care. Toby, look, look how long your hair is getting. All right, let's go. These bugs are horrid. Calibre. What is it? Calibre. Do you guys see that? 73 degrees and raining. How are we expected to find anything like this? We got a snake in the rain. Cold, wet rain. What kind of snake do we have? Super gorgeous ribbon snake. Look at me shaking. He's so cold. Leave it to Thamnophis. You guys, we are turning around. We may have seen a snake because, you know, it's 73 degrees and cold rain. So why not move across the road, snaky snakes? All right, guys. Rain, rain, go away, come again another day. Big, huge garter snake. At least for Florida, that's a big garter snake. He's hunting frogs. Look at him, that's so cool. See him wiggling his head side to side. Oh, he's going for that frog. Let's help him out. He smells it. Look at him. Look at that. I'm hand feeding a garter snake in the road. Okay. Here. All right, buddy. Take your meal and go. Here. Let me help you. It's with your meal. That was cool. That was such a cool experience. Like every night we got, we're like, oh man, it's raining. We're not going to see that. And Brett never believes me because it's raining. And he's like, there's no point in going out. Like it's raining. And I was like, I know you're an old man herper mentality. 
makes you think that we can't find things in the rain or during full moon, but my young mind mentality knows we can. I know it's tough being old, right, Rhett? I wonder how far away he could smell that frog for, yeah. from. We saved a garter and we fed a garter. Fed we him saved dinner. Him. That was so cool. What kind of frog was it? It was a dead leopard frog, a big leopard mm, frog. Yum, delicious, my favorite. Just kidding, I don't eat frogs. But my dad used to eat frog legs, I guess. We should cook some dead frogs. Don't show us our cuteness again. It's the only reason people watch these videos. But yeah, suck your thumb. Here you go. Tub tub. You want it? I'm like so obsessed with him, I can't help it. Are you cleaning it? <laughs> oh, okay. Well, you know what? You're just so incredibly rude, Toby. I can't handle you. Thank you, Toby. Wow. We are gonna see so many snakies now with that clean windshield. This is actually doing pretty good. I'm impressed. I'm not gonna lie. This is this is. He's doing the sunroof. You're such an overachiever. Okay, guys, it's day number two. Toby cleaned the windshields or the windshield, so we are good to go. And it has been nothing but cold and rainy. Like for, for Florida, it's super cold. It's gonna drop into the 60s. So come on, get away from the gas tank. Let's go, everything is clean. Let's see what we can find. We're not gonna see anything. Toby, where are you going? We can find if we can find some stuff to flip, we could find some stuff. Let's find something. Can <laughs> get you <laughs> You cheesing at me? Oh, there he goes. Gonna get you. Oh, he's getting sand all over the car. Get out of the car. Get out of the car, Toby. Ah, he's got me. Where is he? I can just. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. Oh, that's how I caught him. Dude, he was leaving me in the dust. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? <gasps> Dude, he's fast. Oh no, here he goes. Pessimistic me, and we found a snake. Oh, oh, he's tough. He's cool. He's trying to do the, like, that Miami look in a way. Oh, yeah, it's a real pretty one. Look, he's, he's spicy. He is spicy. You see that? But spicy to me is like black pepper, so, you know. <laughs> oh, yeah, he's, like, real pretty. He's trying to be a... Ooh. We stop, oh, Tope, Tope, come on. No, you get in the car. You don't nice, have to pretty corn snake. And it's cold, it's like 72. Yeah, and he was basking on the road. And the no sun. Look at him ticking around. Look at him, I yeah, love the head. That? It's the head tick. Pygmies and stuff do that. Rattling too. Alright, let me see the ventral. That's cool. Hold still. <laughs> Tope, stop. Alright, ready to let it go? It's gorgeous. Oh, no, wrong way. Oh, there you go. You can kind of see it from the car. We were driving, and I just spotted, see that little loopy thing out of the corner of my eye? I spotted a green snake while we were driving. Tub, do you want to go see the green snake? Tub, what is it? <laughs> okay. Very grumpy face, man. Here, come look at the green snake, okay? It's a whopper. rough green. Now I think this is actually a new county for us. Not that it matters. Uh, look at his little face. <laughs> He's just rocking in the wind. Oh, 
All right, so despite cold and windy, we still found two snakes. Hi. Look at like, tell me this isn't a weird looking little corn snake. It's so white. Yeah, that's a super nice corn. Hold on. Here, you gotta show the camera. Sorry, he's moving. I'm trying not to blind you. Why is he so cute? Is he a morph or something? Uh, he's just super high. I mean, I'm sure he probably just turns into that like uglier like beige when he's older. Okay, guys, trying to walk through this tall grass. That's as tall as me. His red. I think he said he found a another rough green snake. Oh, he's so tiny. Hope he's running. Oh. Oh, he's so cute. Hey, little dude. Why have we been finding? We didn't find any of these for like what a year, and now we just keep finding them. God, there's just such a nice snake. Like that's just such a nice green and yellow. Yeah, they're gorgeous. Put him away. Let him go eat his bugs. Caterpillar or snake? Caterpillar. Alright guys, I saw we were driving. While we were driving, I spotted another green snake. Oh, I think I see it. We, we walked past it. Say hey, look. We walked past it. It's right here. It was on your side. Another baby. Look. Oh, I woke him up. It's like uh, not as tiny as Toby. 